In mathematics and specifically in topology, rational homotopy theory is a simplified version of homotopy theory for topological spaces, in which all torsion in the homotopy groups is ignored. It was founded by Dennis Sullivan and Daniel Quillen This simplification of homotopy theory makes calculations much easier. Rational homotopy types of simply connected spaces can be identified with isomorphism classes of certain algebraic objects called Sullivan minimal models, which are commutative differential graded algebras over the rational numbers satisfying certain conditions. A geometric application was the theorem of Sullivan and Michelin Vigue Poirier. Every simply connected closed Riemannian manifold X whose rational cohomology ring is not generated by one element has infinitely many geometrically distinct closed geodesics. The proof used rational homotopy theory to show that the Betti numbers of the free loop space of X are unbounded. The theorem then follows from a 1969 result of Detlef Grommel and Wolfgang Mayer. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Rational spaces. A continuous map F x y display style F colon x to y of simply connected topological spaces is called a rational homotopy equivalence if it induces an isomorphism on homotopy groups tensored with the rational numbers Q equivalently, F is a rational homotopy equivalence if and only if it induces an isomorphism on singular homology groups with rational coefficients. The rational homotopy category of simply connected spaces is defined to be the localization of the category of simply connected spaces with respect to rational homotopy equivalences. The goal of rational homotopy theory is to understand this category. That is, if one declares all rational homotopy equivalences to be isomorphisms, how much information is left? One basic result is that the rational homotopy category is equivalent to a full subcategory of the homotopy category of topological spaces, the subcategory of rational spaces. By definition, a rational space is a simply connected CW complex all of whose homotopy groups are vector spaces over the rational numbers. For any simply connected CW complex x there is a rational space x q display style x underscore math bf q unique up to homotopy equivalence with a map x x q display style x to x underscore math bf q that induces an isomorphism on homotopy groups tensored with the rational numbers the space X Q display style X underscore math BF Q is called the rationalization of X display style X this is a special case of Sullivan's construction of the localization of a space at a given set of prime numbers one gets equivalent definitions using homology rather than homotopy groups namely a simply connected cw complex x display style x is a rational space if and only if its homology groups h i x z display style h underscore i x math bf z are rational vector spaces for all i greater than Zero. Display style i greater than zero. The rationalization of a simply connected CW complex X. Display style X is the unique rational space X. X. Q. Display style X to X underscore math BF Q up to homotopy equivalence with a map X. X Q display style X to X underscore math BF Q 
that induces an isomorphism on rational homology. Thus one has pi i x q pi i x q display style pi underscore i x underscore math bf q kong pi underscore i x o times math bf q and h i x q z h i x z q h i x q display style h underscore i x underscore math bf q math bf z kong h underscore i x math bf z o times math bf q kong h underscore i x math bf q for all i greater than zero. These results for simply connected spaces extend with little change to nilpotent spaces spaces whose fundamental group is nilpotent and acts nilpotently on the higher homotopy groups. Computing the homotopy groups of spheres is a central open problem in homotopy theory. However, the rational homotopy groups of spheres were computed by Jean-Pierre Serra in 1951. Pi i s 2 a minus 1 q q if i equals 2 a minus 1 o. Otherwise, display style pi underscore i s caret 2 a minus 1 o times math bf q kong begin cases math bf q and text if i equals 2 a minus 1 0 and text otherwise end cases and pi i s 2 a q Q if I equals two or, or I equals four a minus one o. Otherwise, display style pi underscore i s caret two a o times math bf q kong begin cases math bf q and text if I equals two a text or I equals four a minus one zero and text otherwise end cases. This suggests the possibility of describing the whole rational homotopy category in a practically computable way. Rational homotopy theory has realized much of that goal. In homotopy theory, spheres and ehlenberg maclane spaces are two very different types of basic spaces from which all spaces can be built. In rational homotopy theory, these two types of spaces become much closer. In particular, Serra's calculation implies that S two a minus one q is the ehlenberg maclane space K q two a minus one. More generally, let X be any space whose rational cohomology ring is a free graded commutative algebra, a tensor product of a polynomial ring on generators of even degree and an exterior algebra on generators of odd degree. Then the rationalization XQ is a product of Eilenberg Maclean spaces. The hypothesis on the cohomology ring applies to any compact Lie group or, more generally, any loop space. For example, for the unitary group SU n s u n q s q three times s q five times times s q two n minus one display style SU n underscore math bf q semi q s underscore math bf q caret three times s underscore math bf q caret five times c d o t s times s underscore math bf q caret two n minus one topic cohomology ring and homotopy lie algebra there are two basic invariants of a space x in the rational homotopy category the rational cohomology ring h x q display style h caret asterisk x math bf q and the homotopy lie algebra pi X Q display style pi underscore asterisk X O times math BF Q. The rational cohomology is a graded commutative algebra over Q display style math BF Q, and the homotopy groups form a graded Lie algebra via the Whitehead product. More precisely, writing omega X. Display style omega x 
For the loop space of x, we have that pi omega x q display style pi underscore asterisk omega x o times math bf q is a graded Lie algebra over q display style math bf q in view of the isomorphism pi i x pi i minus one omega x, this just amounts to a shift of the grading by one. For example, Serra's theorem above says that pi asterisk omega s n q is the free graded Lie algebra on one generator of degree n minus one. Another way to think of the homotopy Lie algebra is that the homology of the loop space of x is the universal enveloping algebra of the homotopy Lie algebra. H Omega X Q U Pi Omega X Q Display style H underscore asterisk Omega X Math BF Q Kong U Pi underscore asterisk Omega X O times Math BF Q Conversely, one can reconstruct the rational homotopy Lie algebra from the homology of the loop space as the subspace of primitive elements in the Hoff algebra H omega x, q. A central result of the theory is that the rational homotopy category can be described in a purely algebraic way, in fact, in two different algebraic ways. First, Quillen showed that the rational homotopy category is equivalent to the homotopy category of connected differential graded Lie algebras. The associated graded Lie algebra Kerr D, Im, D is the homotopy Lie algebra. Second, Quillen showed that the rational homotopy category is equivalent to the homotopy category of one connected differential graded cocommutative algebras. The associated algebra is the rational homology of X as a algebra. The dual vector space is the rational cohomology ring. These equivalences were among the first applications of Quillen's theory of model categories. In particular, the second description implies that for any graded commutative Q algebra A of the form A equals Q A two. Three display style a equals math bf q o plus a carrot two o plus a carrot three o plus c d o t s. With each vector space i of finite dimension, there is a simply connected space X whose rational cohomology ring is isomorphic to a. By contrast, there are many restrictions, not completely understood, on the integral or mod p cohomology rings of topological spaces for prime numbers p. In the same spirit, Sullivan showed that any graded commutative Q algebra with A1 equals zero that satisfies Poincaré duality is the cohomology ring of some simply connected smooth closed manifold, except in dimension 4A. In that case, one also needs to assume that the intersection pairing on A2A is of the form plus or minus X2I over Q1 may ask how to pass between the two algebraic descriptions of the rational homotopy category. In short, a Lie algebra determines a graded commutative algebra by Lie algebra cohomology, and an augmented commutative algebra determines a graded Lie algebra by reduced Andre Quillen cohomology. More generally, there are versions of these constructions for differential graded algebras. This duality between commutative algebras and Lie algebras is a version of causal duality. Topic: Sullivan algebras. Equals for spaces whose rational homology in each degree has finite dimension, Sullivan classified all rational homotopy types in terms of simpler algebraic objects, Sullivan algebras. By definition, a Sullivan algebra is a commutative differential graded algebra over the rationals Q, whose underlying algebra is the free commutative graded algebra λ on a graded vector space V equals N greater than zero V N Display style v equals o plus underscore n greater than zero v caret n. 
satisfying the following nilpotence condition on D, V is the union of an increasing series of graded subspaces V, 0, v 1 where d equals 0 on v 0 and d v k is contained in lambda v k minus 1 in the context of differential graded algebras a commutative is used to mean graded commutative that is a b equals minus 1 i j b a Display style ab equals minus one carrot i j bar for in i and b in a j. The Sullivan algebra is called minimal if the image of D is contained in lambda plus v two, where lambda plus v is the direct sum of the positive degree subspaces of lambda v. A Sullivan model for a commutative differential graded algebra A is a Sullivan algebra lambda v with a homomorphism to A that induces an isomorphism on cohomology meaning ker d im d. If A O equals Q then A has a minimal Sullivan model which is unique up to isomorphism. Warning: A minimal Sullivan algebra with the same cohomology algebra as A need not be a minimal Sullivan model for A. It is also necessary that the isomorphism of cohomology be induced by a homomorphism of differential graded algebras. There are examples of non-isomorphic minimal Sullivan models with isomorphic cohomology algebras. equals Topic: The Sullivan minimal model of a topological space. Equals: For any topological space X, Sullivan defined a commutative differential graded algebra APL X called the algebra of polynomial differential forms on X with rational coefficients. An element of this algebra consists of roughly a polynomial form on each singular simplex of X, compatible with face and degeneracy maps. This algebra is usually very large uncountable dimension, but can be replaced by a much smaller algebra. More precisely, any differential graded algebra with the same Sullivan minimal model as APL X is called a model for the space X when X is simply connected. Such a model determines the rational homotopy type of X to any simply connected CW complex X with all rational homology groups of finite dimension. There is a minimal Sullivan model lambda v for APL X, which has the property that v1 equals zero and all the vk have finite dimension. This is called the Sullivan minimal model of X. It is unique up to isomorphism. This gives an equivalence between rational homotopy types of such spaces and such algebras with the properties. The rational cohomology of the space is the cohomology of its Sullivan minimal model. The spaces of indecomposables in V are the duals of the rational homotopy groups of the space X. The Whitehead product on rational homotopy is the dual of the quadratic part of the differential D. Two spaces have the same rational homotopy type if and only if their minimal Sullivan algebras are isomorphic. There is a simply connected space X corresponding to each possible Sullivan algebra with V1 equals 0 and all the VK of finite dimension. When X is a smooth manifold, the differential algebra of smooth differential forms on X the de Rham complex is almost a model for X. More precisely, it is the tensor product of a model for X with the reals and therefore determines the real homotopy type. One can go further and define the p-completed homotopy type of X for a prime number p. Sullivan's arithmetic square reduces many problems in homotopy theory to the combination of rational and p-completed homotopy theory. For all primes p, the construction of Sullivan minimal models for simply connected spaces extends to nilpotent spaces. For more general fundamental groups, things get more complicated, for example, the rational homotopy groups of a finite CW complex such as the wedge S1 S2 can be infinite dimensional vector spaces. Formal spaces
Topic: A commutative differential graded algebra A again with A O. Q is called formal if A has a model with vanishing differential. This is equivalent to requiring that the cohomology algebra of A viewed as a differential algebra with trivial differential is a model for A though it does not have to be the minimal model. Thus the rational homotopy type of a formal space is completely determined by its cohomology ring. Examples of formal spaces include spheres, H-spaces, symmetric spaces, and compact Kala manifolds. Formality is preserved under products and wedge sums. For manifolds, formality is preserved by connected sums. On the other hand, closed nilmanifolds are almost never formal. If M is a formal nilmanifold, then M must be the torus of some dimension. The simplest example of a non formal nilmanifold is the Heisenberg manifold, the quotient of the Heisenberg group of real 3 times 3 upper triangular matrices with ones on the diagonal by its subgroup of matrices with integral coefficients. Closed symplectic manifolds need not be formal. The simplest example is the Codera Thurston manifold, the product of the Heisenberg manifold with a circle. There are also examples of non-formal, simply connected symplectic closed manifolds. Non-formality can often be detected by Massey products. Indeed, if a differential graded algebra A is formal, then all higher order Massey products must vanish. The converse is not true. Formality means, roughly speaking, the uniform vanishing of all Massey products. The complement of the Borromean rings is a non-formal space, it supports a non-trivial triple Massey product. Examples If X is a sphere of odd dimension 2n plus 1 greater than 1, its minimal Sullivan model has one generator of degree 2n plus 1 with da equals 0, and a basis of elements 1, a. If X is a sphere of even dimension 2n greater than 0, its minimal Sullivan model has two generators a and b of degrees 2n and 4n minus 1, with db. Topic A two da zero and a basis of elements one a b a two ab a three a two b a four where the arrow indicates the action of d. If X is the complex projective space C P n with n greater than zero, its minimal Sullivan model has two generators u and x of degrees two and two n plus one with do. Topic zero and dx un plus one. It has a basis of elements one u u two un x un plus one zu un plus two, where the arrow indicates the action of d. Suppose that V has four elements a, b, x, y of degrees two, three, three, and four with differentials da. Topic zero db zero dx topic a two dy ab then this algebra is a minimal Sullivan algebra that is not formal. The cohomology algebra has non-trivial components only in dimension 2, 3, 6, generated respectively by A, B and X B minus A. Any homomorphism from V to its cohomology algebra would map Y to 0 and X to a multiple of B, so it would map X B minus A to 0. So V cannot be a model for its cohomology algebra. The corresponding topological spaces are two spaces with isomorphic rational cohomology rings but different rational homotopy types. Notice that X B minus A is in the Massey product A A B display style Langle A A B Wrangle. Topic 
Elliptic and hyperbolic spaces Rational homotopy theory revealed an unexpected dichotomy among finite CW complexes, either the rational homotopy groups are zero in sufficiently high degrees, or they grow exponentially. Namely, let X be a simply connected space such that H X, Q is a finite dimensional Q vector space for example, a finite CW complex has this property. Define X to be rationally elliptic if π X Q is also a finite dimensional Q vector space, and otherwise rationally hyperbolic. Ben Felix and Halperin showed, if X is rationally hyperbolic, then there is a real number C greater than 1 and an integer n such that I equals 1 n dim Q pi I X Q C n Display style sum underscore i equals one carrot n operator name dim underscore math bf q pi underscore i x o times math bf q g e q c carrot n for all n n for example spheres complex projective spaces and homogeneous spaces for compact Lie groups are elliptic. On the other hand, most finite complexes are hyperbolic. For example. The rational cohomology ring of an elliptic space satisfies Poincaré duality. If X is an elliptic space whose top non-zero rational cohomology group is in degree n, then each Betti number by X is at most the binomial coefficient n i display style binom n i with equality for the n-dimensional torus. The Euler characteristic of an elliptic space X is non-negative. If the Euler characteristic is positive, then all odd Betti numbers B two A plus one X are zero, and the rational cohomology ring of X is a complete intersection ring. There are many other restrictions on the rational cohomology ring of an elliptic space. Bott's conjecture predicts that every simply connected closed Riemannian manifold with non-negative sectional curvature should be rationally elliptic. Very little is known about the conjecture, although it holds for all known examples of such manifolds. A simply connected finite complex X is rationally elliptic if and only if the rational homology of the loop space omega X grows at most polynomially. More generally, X is called integrally elliptic if the mod p homology of omega X grows at most polynomially. For every prime number p, all known Riemannian manifolds with non-negative sectional curvature are in fact integrally elliptic. Equals equals notes. <laughs>